welcome you here. So, uh, sorry, we started. We yeah. Started. Yeah. Okay. So let's. Um, uh, you are known to the public as a, as a crime organization uh, boss. Um, it's clear that you are being bombarded with uh, hundreds of demos every month. Uh, uh, what's your uh, major selection criteria? Uh, I ignore most of it because I don't want to sit there and download stuff all day. It's really impossible. Yeah. So most of the things I really listen to are the demos that I get from friends or from people that I know, okay. uh, musicians that I know, or somehow people that can attract attention in some kind of way, which is not an invitation to try to yeah. attract attention, yeah. because some people are too annoying. They send me something, and okay, did you listen, did you listen, did you listen? I have no time, you know? Yeah. I don't want to sit there and download demos all day, or um, yeah. Yeah, or promos, or just new stuff. It's like it's it's too much. You have to yeah. somehow shield yourself from that. Yeah, bit. yeah, yeah. So uh, I try, but uh, uh, yeah, mostly uh, if something has a reference. Yeah, it comes recommended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's the trick. Oh, okay. Um, that's uh, what's your. Uh, I know daily routine and does it affect your music preference? What do you mean? I mean um, uh, your your lifestyle is it somehow you know affected? I have pretty normal lifestyle. Okay. I live together with my girlfriend. She okay. goes to work. I get up and go to yeah. the office, which happens yeah, yeah, yeah. to be in the other room. Uh, I just uh, I don't know check uh, if there's anything interesting going on updates um, maybe try to work on some releases this and that there's just mainly it's uh, kind of office work you know because it mostly it's just answering emails and talking to people and listening to things okay. it's just like I don't know it's uh, bookkeeping it's the same oh, okay. stuff you would do uh, working for a, a small sized uh, architect firm. Oh, okay. Or whatever, I'm the janitor and the, yeah, yeah. the manager, but I have other people that I work together with for the yeah, production yeah. and the artwork and obviously the music, so I keep in touch with these people, I speak with them a lot. And okay, so it's so time like, I just, uh, uh, some somehow this, uh, office style, yeah? Yeah, yeah, you just, you know, it doesn't just run by itself. Yeah, yeah, So sure. um, Yeah, I don't know, that's pretty normal lifestyle, I guess, and then in the, in the evening I try not to do too much. I, I try okay. to stay off the internet because I don't want it to be uh, non-stop uh, okay. in my life, you know. Like, I want so you keep some time to... Yeah, but if yeah, there's something for, important, for, for you know, of course I will answer that, but uh, yeah, yeah, it's better to have time away yeah. from that. Yeah. Um, that inevitably, inevitably brings us to uh, Cream Organization uh, artworks. Yeah. Uh, what inspires you and your team? My team, my my crack team of professionals. Well, uh, my artwork team is one guy. That's uh, Godspill, and he's okay. uh, probably my best friend. Don't tell him that, but uh, yeah, that's what he is, and uh, he does everything. Pretty much, not okay. everything, but most of it, and I don't really have to speak with him that much about what he needs to make or this or that. And yeah, he just makes things, and I use them, um, and it's always good. Okay, but uh, it just comes out of nowhere, and uh... I don't know you, but that's something you should ask him where it comes from. But I don't okay. know if I he could tell you that. But uh, we kind of discuss things sometimes, like, hey, can you make something like this or that or da da da? And I say I want this, and we make something completely different. And, so it's uh, just uh, a chemistry, yeah? Yeah, that's a, that's an expensive word for it, but I think he's just a good artist and he oh, okay. makes interesting things. And once you put it together with the music, the story makes itself because. Um, once it's there together, people make that connection in their mind. Oh, okay. and you just do that. That's how the human brain works a bit, I think. So uh, the plan is that there's not a big plan. That I'm just yeah. very lucky that uh, he is such a big part of that. That is always uh, around. It's always good. Okay. Thanks. Um, uh, what would you uh, prefer, uh, a hardware-based sound or a software-based sound? A good sound. I don't 
care where it comes from, from my grandma's butt or <laughs> from the most expensive synthesizer ever made. It's totally irrelevant. So I just the sound is good. I don't know why or how. I don't want to know anything. Okay. Just make it how you make it. You know, people use what they use. Uh, um, you cannot don't dictate how somebody should work. You know, if some people made the best stuff on one little laptop with samples and they know how to work it, you know, you will not yeah. tell the difference with your uh, blindfold on, really, no. It's impossible. I don't care what anybody says. Okay. Mastering techniques that uh, are used by Korean organization. I have a special, uh, well, one, one good person who does all the mastering now. Yeah. Uh, so. Is it uh, digital, analog? That's the same question. I yeah. think for him it's, it depends on the source material, I think, but uh, par partially it's, it's analog these days, I think, but I'm not 100% sure what he does. Maybe yeah. he doesn't do anything, just tells me that he does something and just runs it through the maximizer. Okay. And uh, I'm stupid enough to buy into uh, okay. it, I don't know. But uh, it used to be pretty much digital mostly, now it's mixed, I think. Uh, okay. Uh, is there any uh, non electronic music that you like? Yeah, so much, you know. Electronic music is, is cool and everything, but I like music and I don't. Okay. It's the same, how it's made, whatever. I like uh, lots of things. Rock uh, music, any particular names? Music, reggae, this, that, uh, hip hop. Any particular. No, that's too hard to say because if I'll say one thing, it doesn't do justice yeah. because it will be the first thing that comes in my mind but it will not be much more important than the other things that I didn't think of and then I will think later, I should have said oh, this yeah. or that. It's, I just like uh, lots of music. This is, it's maybe easier to say what I don't like. Oh, okay. uh, that's modern ska music, I don't like it at all. And uh, what else don't I like? Uh, commercial house, crappy. Okay. Um, I'm not too much into uh, that kind of stuff, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, do you like or uh, do you do any sports? Oh, that's a good question. I wish I did now, but yeah, well, I don't know. Not in any kind of uh, organized or structural way, but I ride a bicycle. You know, okay. Sometimes now, uh, which is a very nice way to get around the city. I think I walk. I used to play some squash and stuff, but uh, oh, I squash! I that's played cool. with one guy, but he's. In another country, so I don't kind of stop doing it. Do you support any uh, football team? No. Okay. No. Um, there hasn't been too uh, many electro releases recently uh, from Cream Organization. Uh, why? Do you like any uh, appropriate material? Uh, what you mean? What, 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 like electro? Uh, like like? Uh, sorry, I have to think of a second for the word, but. What do you mean, like traditional electro yeah. releases? But like, what, what kind? Like more techno electro or old school hip hop electro? Or? Uh, I believe old school electro. Yeah, I don't know. It's what people make, you know, kind of. And uh, if I like it, I like it. But it's not, I don't get that much stuff in that genre that I like. Or I think, like, uh, but well, we had DJ Overdose album, which was kind of real electro record, yeah. I think. And there's been a few, but in general it's just uh, what people come up with. And I think in some ways that sound is also a little bit pushed to its limits. Okay. You know, I, I, I'm 
I probably will be proved wrong five minutes after I say this, but <laughs> I don't know which direction it can okay. go that it hasn't already been in, which would be interesting, you know. Uh, I mean, well, again, overdose and that kind of Nova Man, that kind of stuff is really great. Uh, so if I if they give me something, I will probably release it, you know. But um, for the rest, I haven't heard that many things that okay. I found spectacular and didn't think like, yeah, I heard that record ten years ago. Also, you know, because that the peak of electro, that kind of sound in the early 2000s, kind of burned itself yeah. out because how many. Uh, at some point, how many Doppler effect, Drexia, da 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 da, influenced the acts can you have, or like real like rip offs almost. Uh, oh, okay. You know, just, mm, yeah, kind of hit it in the dead end street or something. Yeah. At some point. I see. Uh, do you still like jungle um, yeah, and sure. drum yeah, bass? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, but I'm not really sure about what's new or something. I, I don't follow that at all. I don't know what's coming out, or I just like the old stuff, you know. Um, any particular names again? I don't know, just uh, the, the classics, I'd say. Uh, okay, uh, uh, oh, what was your longest set? Oh, uh, I'm not entirely sure, but it wasn't super long, like some people have these marathon things where they go for two days, but uh, I don't know, five, six hours maybe? Like that. Yeah, yeah but still, that's... Uh, that takes some time and effort. Yeah, because I play a lot of records also. Yeah. Like I, I always play a lot in one hour, so it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, there's 200 records maybe, I don't know, something like that. <laughs> yeah. And um, can you share your experience with Red Bull Music Academy? Uh, well, I haven't had that many direct experiences, I think, with Red Bull. I'm, of course, I know about the the music academy in every city in these cities every year and I've had some people that were either directly involved or as uh, students or as whatever speakers but until uh, I get a bit more involved which yeah. I would like also uh, I don't really know what to say about it it seems like a good thing I think I mean yeah it seems like a oh. nice way to uh, promote say, promote and introduce yeah. people to uh, to music so Okay, that uh, actually brings us to the end of the interview. Thank you for talking to us, really. And thank you for uh, coming to Ekaterinburg and we are, thank you, for you know, uh, uh, relishing the uh, uh, tonight's set of yours. The pressure is enormous now. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Нормально?